Hi guys, this is Badra. Today we are going to discuss on uh, future methods. We have a challenge here uh, in trailhead. So create an Apex class that uses a future annotation to update account records. Create an Apex class with a method using the future annotation that accepts a list of account IDs and updates a custom field on the account object with the number of contacts associated to the account write unit tests that achieve 100 percent code coverage for the class first create a field on the account object called number of contacts of type number this field will hold the total number of contacts for the account so copy the field name go to the developer edition click on the accounts tab click on the force.com and uh, click on the view fields here we have account custom fields and relationships click on the next type is number click on next paste the field name automatically field label name will come sorry field name will come if we enter field label click on next check this visible check this read only click on next click on save so we have uh, number of contacts field in account object so go to the challenge create an apex class called account processor that contains a count contacts method that accepts a list of account ids this method must use the feature annotation so copy the class name go to the developer edition click on the username select developer console maximize click on the file click on new select apex class enter the class name click ok for future methods we should use feature annotation so we have uh, method count contacts for future methods we should use static for every method after this method accepts list of account IDs since it is a custom field from account where id in we are getting a list of ids so i am uh, using the where condition in
account and contact and uh, add uh, account details into the this list present in uh, list A1 click on save control S go to the challenge and we have uh, create an apex test class called account processor test so we need to create uh, account processor test the unit tests must cover all the lines of code included in the account processor class resulting in 100% code coverage ok let me go to the developer console click on the new file click on the apex class enter the class name click ok since it is a test class I am using Standations. They didn't mention anything about uh, method name uh, persists in uh, test class, so I am giving uh, uh, any one uh, any name like. Uh, Account with contacts. between account and uh, contact here and I'm waiting one more contact Uh, 
class containing count contents since it is a feature method and uh, it has a static method so I am calling directly with the class method we call the uh, apex class method in between test dot start test and test dot stop test means it will execute the code in asynchronous mode so save it click on the test new run click on the account process we will get the method uh, persist in the account processor tests check the checkbox and click on the run you can see whether your code has tests or not here tests and the account processor code coverage is 100 percent so code has worked right now so I am going to the challenge so I am using different uh, version logged in Click on the check challenge to earn 500 points. Thanks, guys, for watching. Please like and subscribe this video if you want to get more videos from me please subscribe the channel and comment for this video if you want any uh, doubts on the salesforce you can ask in comments thanks guys